Gods of Urumba Kingdom. What? What do you... What do you have me... do? Did I not tell you I was going to deal with you? Did I not say that to you? I told you, pray! Pray because I will deal with you. A slave you are and a slave you forever remain. That is what I want. I was talking and you were talking. Talk now. Are you now dumb? You imbecile. Talk. Talk back at me. Talk back at me. That's what I say. You can't talk anymore. Talk back at me now. Talk back at me. I am talking to you. You're not my sister again. You're not my elder sister again, right? Nonsense. Let, 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 let me see how you wear all those hair. All, all the hairs that, 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 that your stupid mother bought for you. Come and wear them, let me see. Get out! Talk back at me. Talk back at me, Kambili. You imbecile of a human being. You talk to me. Talk back at me now. I waited for this day. I patiently waited for this day to finish you. I am not done with you. You're staring at me in that manner. Why are you staring at me like that? Talk back at me, you octopus of... I don't even know what to call you. What are you? What are you? Let me... Tell me what to call you. How dare you try to talk my son into marrying Princess uh, Adura's uh, younger sister? Why? For what? No, what's the meaning of that, 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 that stupid nonsense? Why? Did you Eh? Is that why you're shouting? Why would I shout? Can't you understand this? Understand what? If your son marries the princess uh, Somachi, uh -huh. definitely he will become the king. So why why can't you understand it? Understand what? Why are you listening to your enos? Eh? Uh, oh wait, because of uh, stupid royal benefits, you 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 want to talk my son into licking the ass, the very dirty ass of of of. of of, of that stupid idiotic game? Eh? Why? For what? This I don't want that. I don't want any stupid royal benefits from that stupid royal household. I don't want anything from them. Ejofo, don't judge from that angle. That the Hedda sister messed up does not mean that her junior sister is bad. This Somachi is a good girl. Yes. What makes you a good girl? So you don't know. Is you she don't not know. from the same stupid royal household? Listen to me, I don't want anything from that royal household. I don't want anything from the king, I don't want anything from the queen, I don't want anything from their useless daughters. Please, I don't ever want to hear that you went to my son's house to bamboozle him or to, to try to convince him to do that nonsense, to, that stupid thing you, you have in your head. I don't want it. I don't want him to marry from the royal household. Please, just stop it right now. Stop hey, for stop all of us will benefit. Stop. All of us will benefit. And who doesn't like good thing? Hey, for uh -huh. So this boy told his father to come and warn me. Hey, I'm in trouble because I I, I don't take bribe. I don't have eaten bribe. I don't know. This girl will come after me and my own is finished. I will run away from this community. Go to the township and stay with my daughter so that I will be safe. This girl will kill me with, 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 with her wickedness. That's all I will do. <laughs> bribe. Hey. I'm in trouble. Your Highness, what else are we waiting for? The throne is empty and the queen has to be crowned. We can no more wait. More so, our festival is fast approaching. We cannot celebrate without a queen. Your Highness, please do something towards this direction. Do something very quick. The daughter of late King Alfred, Princess Adore, is the best woman for you. Your Highness, she is a queen from bed. Elelewe John, Okura Wahango, Ugobechi, Ehonwa. This 
girl is the best for you, your highness. Uh, yes, your highness. Ichi Amade here is right. In fact, we have gone to consult the gods with all the necessary requirements. And they have proved that uh, Princess Adure is your rightful wife. And that was why your first marriage with a, uh, Queen Annie failed. Because she was not your wife. But Princess Adure is your wife. Please do something. Our kingdom needs a queen. Please, Your Highness. Please. Brother, I think the others are right. We really need a queen before the festive period. My elders. My dear sister. I've heard everything you say. But the truth remains that I won't be in a haste to do anything. I need to take my time. But then again, I assure all of you that in no distant time, we will go to Oru Kingdom, get their princess, and marry her as my wife. <laughs> Your Highness, which date? Time. We are inquisitive to know because we have to get prepared. It's okay, we will schedule another meeting right here in my palace. Then we can discuss the time and the date. That shouldn't be a problem. It's all right, Your Highness. That's very good. We are waiting. Brother, you know I will always support you. As long as the decision you are making is good for the both of us. Maya. Brother. Marriage is not what you think it is. Marriage is way beyond all the king and queen bubbles. I don't want to be a victim of hate, anger, uncertainties. Aduri has proven that she is a well brought up lady. Yes. But there is something I asked her to do for me and I'm still waiting for that. And what is that? A lesson. I don't want to rush into marriage. I feel marriage is something that we just have to take our time. We should take our time, know each other, understand each other, know if it's going to work or not. I'll be with my friend, I understand you. I mean, I know where you're coming from, but you see, my brother, our king, he cannot keep residing on the throne without a queen. Besides, our festive season is fast approaching, you know? I really need both of you to like maybe come together and work out this marriage of a thing. I really do think so. Okay, you know, I don't want to sound like some desperate woman. But I think about it. I mean, if it makes you happy, I will gladly do it. Thank you. You're welcome. I really appreciate it. So what about your stepsister? Nah. When are we seeing her? Yes, this weekend. You know, Kambli is one psycho fanatic coconut head. Trust me. I can't wait for you to meet her. You will see what I am talking about. I just hope she does not disgrace me. No, no, no. I don't think she will. Really? I don't think she will. Just bring her. <laughs> um, I'm Chet. <laughs>
They killed my parents. They killed my mommy. Look at what they did to me. Oh Lord. Lord, just look at me. No. I will expose them. I will have to leave this palace. I will run. I will tell everyone in the kingdom. I need to tell the elders. I need to tell Onowu. Yes, I have to go now. What did you conclude with the Obudu elders? Well, mother, they're still trying to make him reason. You know, I just can't wait to leave this palace and become the queen of Obudu Kingdom. Why don't you quit the pretense and go tell him how you feel? Are you forcing me? No. But we all know how desperate you've been to occupy that position. What changed? I mean, why, who, who are you hiding it from? Me or mom? Watch your mouth. I wasn't talking to you, you loud, pig-mouthed idiot. Mom, you started it. Must sister always abuse me? Did I say anything wrong now? Exactly, you did. Why can't you be at peace with your spirit? Who, who is that? Me, me. Oh. Wait, 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 oh. wait, 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 I want to go! I want to leave this place, okay? I don't want to be here anymore! Why am I here? What am I doing here? Just let me go! I want to go! You evil and demonic queen! What? What is this? What is this? What? Did you just call my mother? You heard me! Evil people! Monsters! How I, 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 I want to go! I want to go! I want to go! Just let me go! I want to go! I want to go! That! I want to go! Take her away! Lock her up! And give her the bitch of a miserable pathetic life! Leave me! Now move! Move! Oh. You stand up! Move it! Leave me alone! Leave me! I said she leave me alone! Leave me alone! Leave me alone! Cut, cut! I spit on your grave! Evil people! Monsters! That's what you are! Wait! I want you to lock her up. Henceforth, she's a prisoner in this palace. Lock her without food. I'm not your prisoner! Oh. I am not your prisoner! Such a nuisance. He's Mom. thinking one of that. I don't understand the reason this idiot is still alive. Why is she still in this palace? You can actually make her mad or even disappear. Not now. That time will come. It has to be one thing at a time. It's a guy that will first. So back to our discussion. Hmm. Come tell me more about the dealings of Obudu. Kingdom! <laughs> I want to know. Yes! My queen, we are not happy. In fact, we are over worried. We are sad. We want to know the whereabouts of our princess, Kambiri. A princess of this kingdom, a maiden of this kingdom. We need to know about her whereabouts. You told us that she went to London to that time. And up till now, we've never heard anything about her or her whereabouts. Not in known of her. 
Now we need the international number of that daughter of ours, Kambiri. So that we call her and hear things from her, ourselves. I don't have it. You don't have it? Mm. This is not working. <laughs> it's not working at all. My queen, you say you don't have it. Well, why didn't you send your own daughter, Princess Adore, to London? Yes, you would have sent her. I don't believe your story is not clear to me. In any case, I want to see the princess, Queen Uloma's daughter, here. Good. That's all. Well, she'll be back and you will see her. When is she coming back? When will she be back? Eh? She'll come back and you will see her. I don't want the guards of this kingdom to embarrass elders like you. With all due respect, we are still mourning a king and a queen in this palace. And I want you to accord this household that respect. If you don't trust your queen, I will give you the address to the king's company, your late king's company in London. You go there and see Cambly yourselves. I was on the call when they told me that you guys came. Hey. So I would love to go and finish what I was doing before you interrupted my business call. Hmm. This is not happening. Oh no. Mm -hmm. She walked about or not. Many what? Well, what is happening here? Can someone tell me what the matter is? Is this happening in our kingdom or? Well, oh no. I hope you say that when a man set out for a journey and has even not arrived at his destination, the journey still rests on his feet. In any case, I don't think the queen is paying our intelligence. I don't really think so. I think you're right. But in this case, this is just the beginning of the whole thing. This is not the end of this. No problem, let's go. This is all happening. It is not happening. It cannot be true. I do not want to believe that you men of Obudu are playing with me. Are you? No, my princess. We are not. How can we play with you? So why is it taking your king so much time to come and marry me? For goodness sake, I paid you heavily for this. 500,000 Naira is not a lame business. I'm sorry, my prince, my princess. Uh, 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 please, calm down. Please, let me explain. We have been trying our best for our king to marry you. And we even lied to him. He promised us that very soon that he will come to your kingdom and marry you, please. We will try to... Enough! I do not want any more excuses. It should not exceed this week. Else, you will feel my wrath. God forbid, my princess. Excuse me. This madman is me. Where this madman is he is coming from? Eh? Evil people. Yeah, yeah, not planning on who to kill. Can you take your disgusting, irritating shirtless self out of this place? Well, yeah, not planning how to kill my friend. What to kill my friend again? Get out! You madman! Come on, get out from this place! Where is my friend? Where is my friend? Where is my friend? Ha! Dejected homo sapien. And you better get back to me before the week exceeds. Excuse me.
I want you to be on my side. I don't want the unknown or the youths of this community to start questioning the disappearance of Kambili. Can I be honest with you? She's alive. In fact, she's somewhere around us. Yes. You're married for my kindred. Your late wife was my sister and we were best of friends. Or have you forgotten? I don't want you to join forces in troubling me. Are you assuring me that our princess, Princess Canberra, is alive? You know that once the funeral is announced, she will be needed to give her last respect to her father, our king. She will do just that. She will be at the funeral. I just want you to be on my side. My queen, what do you want me to do? I heard that Ono is planning on staging a protest. Youths of this kingdom getting them to come to the palace demanding about Kambili's whereabouts who raised so many eyeballs and shoulders. I don't want that protest to hold. And I do not want this topic to be ever discussed in this kingdom. I will tell you about everything in due time. Trust me, I will. Don't just allow them. Can you, can you just stop it? Seriously, you can't be chewing gum like some parent decal prostitute. You can't. Yes, this is someone's palace. See, see, eh? Sis, leave me alone. Leave me alone. This is my, this is my life. By the way, what are we doing here? I told you I hate to come to this place. What are we doing here? See. You can't live my life for me. You can't. This is my life. I am Princess Kambili, not you. Can you be calm for a moment? At this point, you are embarrassing me and people are looking at us. Is she your stepsister? Yes, she's my older sister. Do you have a problem with that old man? Oh, sorry, Princess. How are you, Princess Kambiri? Your Highness, I'm fine. I'm okay. People don't say my... <sighs> Sis, I want to smoke. I, I'm, 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 I want to smoke my weed for you. You don't feel me? What? You can't do that here. This is a palace. Excuse me? I cannot do what? Are you mad? You cannot smoke. Are you mad? Mad? you are the one that is mad. Are you okay? You are the one that is mad. You are the one very mad. You tell me how to eat. Your sister has already told me about Will it. Please shut up. I'm seeing it. Shut up. You shut up. You shut up. I'm just living my life. And you don't have the right to tell me how I'm going to live it. Do you hear me? God, I'm respecting you. That's why. I would have been to Are you mad? How dare you tell me how to live my life? You must be very stupid. 
You are mad. Will you shut up? You are coming to a palace of smoke. Are you okay? Please get out from here, Jare. Are you the king? Why will you tell me how to live my life? Princess Maya, it's okay. It's okay. Uh-uh. Here is palace. See, 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 see. Don't, don't you ever, in your, in your whole life, tell me how I'm going to live my life. All right? Don't do that. You can't just smoke in this palace, not so. That was a wonderful display. So this is for you. Voila. Anytime you need me, I'm always available. Okay, <laughs> the mission is achieved. Okay. I'll turn to you. Right. Happy. Right. I'll drop you off. Collins may be your favorite, but we, the people of Orumba Kingdom, want to see our princess Kamile Chukwu. Yes, we want to see her with our naked eyes. We want to see her alive. We want to see her. So, we, all of us will talk. You don't want us to bury my father, the king, right? All I am saying is that I want Chief Collins to take over the throne. Let him wear the crown, whereas I get married to King Jordan of Ubuntu Kingdom. <laughs> Congratulations, my princess. That's a good idea. What we are seeing is that our princess, Kambiri Chuku, must be present in that palace. She is an adult like you. And we must not discuss anything in the palace without her. We want to see her. We want to see her. Well, even, I mean, talk with her. She is part of the marriage. She will be part of it. All of us will rejoice together. It's a good thing we are about to encounter. Eh? Please. All right. Understand me. My princess, understand what I mean.
Hello, how are you and where are you heading to? I'm just coming back from the market. Um, remind me that your name again. <laughs> Amara. Eh, uh, Amara, that's right. Why yes, not sir. hop in? Let me drop you off where you're going to. Oh, thank you, sir. It's really been a while. Come on, let me drop you off. It's okay. <laughs> That was how she sucked us without paying us our salary. Well, um, Amara, as for me, I don't like to talk about that family anymore because they really did me dirty. I mean, they treated me so bad. Anyway, except for the king and his late wife. So sorry about that. It's okay. Anyway, I do rethink she's smart, mm -hmm. but I'm sure she will regret this. Definitely. I'm so sorry for everything they did to you. So, so sorry. Well, it's okay. Well, um, one more favor. Okay, what's that? Um, I'm actually hosting some men from my club this weekend. Oh, so I would okay. love for you to prepare me your favorite vegetable soup. <laughs> okay, no problem. I'll you be sure? Yes. So I'm counting on you. Mm -hmm. No problem, I'll be there. So um, I'll pick you this weekend so you can come make the soup. Okay. All right. Okay. Do have a lovely day. You too. Really yeah. nice seeing you again. Same here. Bye. Yeah. Enjoy your day. It's always painful to see you like this, especially when a child has pain for the sins of the mother. Like you're doing. She's so beautiful and innocent. That doesn't matter, does it? Huh? Does it really matter? You know, honestly, I do not know what to do with you. I don't. I don't know what to do with you again. Just kill me. Huh? Kill me. I want to go and join my mother and my father and they will be so happy to receive me. Okay? Kill me. Why would I do that? It's not part of the plan. You see, I, 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 I can't soil my hands with your blood. Then let me go. Go? Let me go. I want to be out of this place for your children. Just let me go. Why would you be thinking of doing such? This, this whole place, this, 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 I mean, this is your father's palace. Why would you be thinking of leaving? You are the almighty princess Kambili. The one and only favorite. Your palace will be empty when you're gone. So why do you want to go? No, you can't. You cannot. Please. I'm begging you in the name of God. I'm hungry. I'm tired and I'm weak. I, I, I need water. Can you please give me water to drink? Please. You're hungry? <laughs> tired? Thirsty? Why? Have you not been passing urine? <laughs> Have you not been passing? Service. You should use that for your food and drink. Receive saints. Don't you want to go to heaven when you die? You want to live hungry? Come on. You need to enjoy doors. Please, please just let me go. Please let me go. Please, I beg you. <laughs> Let me go! Let me go! Let me go!
Why? Aduri, I want to ask for your hands in marriage. Is we... that supposed to be a proposal? Yes. But I want to do it in your kingdom, in front of everybody. I want you to marry me. Then if we're getting married, what stops you from making love to me? We need to do the right thing. Okay? I just want you to understand. It's okay. Princess Somachi is soon to be crown queen. I I admire the fact that you're proving stubborn with me. That's that's a taste of love, right? I I love every bit of it, but don't stretch it too much because. Whatever Princess so much wants, she gets. Well, my dear Princess So much. Princess So much. If you must know, I do not eat two sisters, and I would never do such a thing. <laughs> Come off it. Be talking about eating two sisters. Come on. When did you become a carnivorous animal that you feed on human flesh? That is awkward. Don't say that again. Anyways, you already know how much I I, I want you. So it's not a big deal to actually clean you up, right? Clean you up to my taste and standard. Clean you up in such a way that you will fit into the society of my social status. So, I hardly change my mind on what I want, whatever princess so much. The crown queen in waiting wants, she gets. Princess Somachi, I have told you countless times without numbers that I do not need your love, friendship, or whatever you have to offer. But yet, you keep showing up at my place whenever you want and proposing this love that I've told you that I don't need. Oh, come on. Don't you have some atom of shame? No. Like I said before, when it comes to the one that I genuinely love, I am shameless. Totally shameless. And need I remind you again that I am the crown queen in waiting. Whatever I want. Princess, so much gets. Well, Let that sink. Well, I would advise you walk away with some sense of pride and prestige like a queen you claim to be. Keep it. I, again, do not need it. Shut up. 
in your wildest dreams. I've seen him before. Really? The other time at the mall, right? Yes. So what does he want? I'm sure he wants some money or food. Get him something now. Get him food or money. What do you think? Okay, um, let's go. Make sure the madman eats it. And when he's done eating, drive him far away from this land. I do not want the madman dying in this palace. Do you understand me? Yes, my present. She poisoned your food. She wants you to die. Your friend is not here. She was locked up in the palace. Say. I want to see my friend. I want to, I want, I want to see my friend. I want to see my friend. I want to see my friend. I want to see my friend Cambly. I want to see my friend Cambly. Please. Give me plenty money. I want to see my friend Cambly. Give plenty money. Plenty money. Plenty. Money plenty. I don't need any money. I will take you to where your friend is. But promise me you won't be violent. Okay, good. I know you're not a violent person. Come, let's go. I'll take you to where your friend is. Okay, let's go. Maya, I am so sorry for keeping you waiting. I had to go and feed the madman. If I don't give him food by myself, he won't eat it. Really? Yes. Well, are you that close? Not really. I just wish I had the scissors. I would have cut off those dirty hairs and beards. Wow. You have such a good heart. Thank you. <laughs> you know, I was actually thinking of building an um, orphanage. We need one. That's nice. And a rehabilitation center for the mentally sick people. Your brother would like that idea, of right? Of course. Hmm. My brother would love to support you. I mean, our company would like to support because it's for humanity. Thank you so much. Meanwhile, what do I offer you? I'm fine. No, you can't be fine. <laughs> I'm okay. Thank you. Okay. If you say so, so, what about your mom? Um, she's fine. Everyone is fine. Good. 
welcome to you. So have you been? I've just been there. <laughs> Nadozi, so you came to see me. I'm so happy to see you. God bless you for coming here. Stop. Don't cry. Okay? Stop crying. Look at me. Stop crying. I am going to be fine. I am going to be... I'm going to be alright and I'm going to be out of this place. Okay? Um, have you... Have you had something to eat? I'm not eating. Look, very soon, hmm? everything is going to be all right. But I need your help. Now, does it look at me? You're my only friend. You're the only friend that I have. I need your help, okay? I need you to listen to me and listen very carefully, okay? I need you to go out there. Hmm? Go into the village. Tell everyone you see. Tell them everything that you know. Did you hear me? Tell them that the queen and her daughters, are you listening to me? They killed my mother, Queen Ola. And they also killed the king, my father. I, I, I overheard them in a conversation. The queen and her daughters were in an argument and I heard everything. Oh. They need you to help me carry this information out there. I know you're listening. I know you understand what I'm saying. Hmm? Tell them I'm in prison. I'm in cell. I need help. I want to be out of this place. Tell them everything. Please, go. Listen. So go. Go, 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 go. Now, go see. This is what... Listen. Wait, wait. let's go. I can help to step. Come. See. Take him, just take him. You have to go. Let's go, let's go. If the, if the case finds find, find me here, I'll no. be in trouble. Let's go, please. Shit. Let's go, please. Let's go. No. My princess. And where is your colleague? I did not see him, my princess. And where is the madman? I have not seen him also, my princess. You did not see him? You're very stupid. You just sit here in the palace and eat like a fool. I'm sorry, my princess. Shut up your trap! I pray I find him. Fool. Look at you. You look like an unprecedented beggar. You are going to die inside here. Toothless bull. I'm not going to die in here. I can smell freedom. I can smell freedom. My freedom is near. God, please bring Nadozie back. Let him get help. My freedom is near. My freedom is now. That's not true. I've been here. It's okay. You did what I asked you to do, right? Yes, my princess. That's what matters.
Change the quid did not just change overnight. Something must have gone wrong somewhere. <laughs> Something like what? Each year. I have forgotten that. If a quest late wife from the same kingdom with Queen Agatha. Hey, but they take inside. Get in the trouble. Get in the nonsense. What kind of rubbish is this? Huh? I don't really know. What? If I catch you, I will kill you. Get away from there. Get away. Get out. Get out! What do you do that? Fool me. Am I the one that made you mad? I don't know. Huh? Wouldn't I have peace again? We are suffering from uh, uh, all this insistent color calamities. Then the mad man's phone has come in as an addition. My brother, Ichie Ibekwe, I had you very clearly. But one thing I want you to understand is this. Ukunaga Warawara. Ayanaga Warawara. Yeah. Eh? The whole thing will come into the limb light. Just calm down for the meantime. Calm down. I must unravel the mystery behind it. Oh no. You do say that Princess Adora wants us to crown Chief Collins as the king of our kingdom? Yes. So she said. But it cannot happen. Really? Yes. Really? As long as I remain the only one of this great kingdom. That well, was not happen. Hmm. And listen again. Yes. I did not give her any audience. Good. I told her I won't grant her audience on this. Until uh, we set our eyes on Princess uh, Kambi. <laughs> that is it. <laughs> oh no. Kita Kibian. Iba kai hangi ya. Let's go. But the issue of the way I said almost a Yes. Will soon be revealed. Good. Yes. I will expose it and make sure that if that is. I don't know. Okonta, my good friend. Yes. We all know that a toad does not scamper in the daytime in vain. That's true. Just as I was saying, mm. if you support me mm. as your friend, yes. the queen mm. will be very happy. Yes. Very, very happy. I don't know whether you understand. I do understand what you just said. Clearly. Good. But the problem is this, my family, they are hungry. I need money. Won't you can give them money? Eh? <laughs> I will do it. I will do it. Money. Money is not a problem. That's I will give you money. Uh -huh. <laughs> money is not a problem. You are heavy. Don't mind this, Aleka. <laughs> I have a message for you. Have a serious. Go ahead. <laughs> How did the madman get to know about all this? He did not tell us the source. He only said that you and your daughters killed our king and Queen Olam. That's not true. It's not true. He's a madman. My queen. Mad people can be communicating with the gods. Perhaps, if you spread this news or this accusation, there'll be dust in this kingdom. But he is insane. Whether he is communicating with the gods or not, he is mad. Don't you know what it takes for someone to lose his sense? He is not in his right sense. Look, Your Majesty, I have seen more days in this kingdom. People might not see it the way you are seeing it now. If you fail to do something about this madman's accusation, you and your daughters will be forced to swear before Amadio, our great deity. And you know what it means to be too bad. You have to do something very urgent. You may leave. Oh, thank you, Majesty. Hmm.
Listen, I want you to, to get me the head of the very madman coming to this palace. I need his head. Mother, that's not even possible. He should be dead by now. Why? I gave the guards a poison food to feed him with. And I told them when they are done feeding him, they should drive him far away from this land. Come on, sis. You behave as if you don't know how these things work. Even you, mom. Mad people are the most difficult set of humans to get killed. You don't just kill them like that. Even with food poisoning. Because most of them are immune to it. So why don't you allow mom to do what's in her mind? Listen. I need his head. Dead or alive. He has a dissenting news. I need his head. Dead or alive. Before dusk on my table. Now move. Yes, Your Majesty. Before they spread news and uh, nonsense rumor about me. You won't be allowed to do that. Mom, I think it's high time you released Kambiri. What for? The elders in council and Onowu has refused to crown your queen. Else Kambiri is released. I... I don't believe that, sis. At least, I know a little about our custom and tradition, mom. It's only until I get a man, that is when I can be crowned queen. Kambili has nothing to do with this. You know, it takes wisdom to rule this kingdom. But sometimes when you talk, it's as if you lacked it. Excuse me, mom. I think your sister is right. Right about what, mom? About us releasing Kambili before you can be able to ascend the throne as a queen. You know, I... I don't know if I am the only one that is having this whole perception about this situation because why would you want us to release Kambili? It's not making sense to me. Mom releasing that little rat is like exposing us to the public. Everything we've done to her, everything you and my sister have done to. Why would you want us to do that? Come on, it's not necessary. I think you're not ready for this battle. Where you are headed, there is no gain. Majesty. Once again, you are welcome to a Buddha kingdom. Thank you so much, Your Majesty. You know, I invited you here to formally inform you that I will be coming to your kingdom, to the palace, to seek for the hands of your princess in marriage. <laughs> what a good news. Ah! Uh, what a good news. Uh, uh, Truly, we are still one in our king, but he has men in the kingdom. People like us will welcome you. Remember, you have been a good ally to our kingdom. Eh? Uh, the kingdom and the uh, Uru kingdom. We are good allies. Hmm? We feel for each other. You are welcome. Thank you. Eh? Uh, Igwe. Uh, I, I guess. They are coming for our princess, Princess Adure. So, now that you've known, if there is anything I need to do prior to the marriage, 
you let me know. Oh. You know, since your king has not been buried. Um, your Majesty. No. Nothing at all. I mean, nothing. Nothing. We are waiting for you. Thank you. No. So my elders and I will be in your kingdom in two days time. That's okay. You people have been friends to our kingdom. Eh? You are a very close friend to our kingdom. No. We can't wait to see you. <laughs> <laughs> so we, we should be lost now. <laughs> Thank you. You can go ahead. Let's celebrate. Majesty. Let me see. Why is he not bleeding? Your Majesty, we found his corpse in the bush, so I had to cut off his head. Twelve were with it. At once. Me, how you imbecile of a human being have been surviving with no food, no water. It does. Well, I can see that some people can never survive without my clothes, shoes, jewelries, mm -hmm. and even my hairs. But news flash. To the glory of God, some of us survive without food and water. <laughs> Thank you. Glory of God! Come on, will you come off it? Glory of God, I can't even come down to save you, right? You know it's a beautiful thing. You've kept saying it, your clothes, your shoes, your this, your that. Yeah, I'm aware they are all yours. That's your stupid mother. But you beautiful things. And guess what? No, news flash as well. They are all mine now. And there is nothing, absolutely nothing you can do about it. I, I will admit that all along I've been so jealous of you. Yeah all along and no not not anymore because looking at you you were a weak dirty disgusting swine octopus what should i even call you that would be enough absolutely nothing so quit shedding those crocodile tears i am not touched guess what what? Even in my downest moment, I am still better than you. And again, <laughs> you will never be queen. Don't you ever. Don't you ever say that again. You will never be queen. I said not you, not your sister. Did you not hear me say don't you ever? You don't know what is coming. I said don't! Something is coming. Tick tock, tick tock. You're not even ready. Because the God that I serve and the God of this land is about to disgrace you and your demonic sister and mother. even as a servant. Now you run along. <laughs> you know what? Mm. You got a savior. Mm. And that savior is this protector. Else, you would be a walking corpse. Of course I will run along, but just zoom. Hey, shut up. I am talking. I said shut up. <laughs> Pray. Pray that I do not become the queen. 
Because if I do, how am I going to make sure I save your head to the dogs of this palace? You don't know what is coming. Did you not hear me say, shut up, my God, and the gods of this land? I agreed with the rare house. Oh no. I agreed with the cheers. Oh no. Um, as the owner who of Urumba Kingdom, the king of Obudu Kingdom invited me to his palace. He made known his intention of marrying our princess to me. They will be here in two days' time. Hmm? Yes. But we agreed as follows after my explanation of our current situation here. One, there will be no form of any event of any type or marriage or whatever ceremony can take place in this palace until we will not only see our princess but she will be there fully we see her in full frame I mean princess Kambiri one of the dads and daughter of this kingdom that was the agreement and on this note, I declare this meeting ended already. Um, Amara, I want to thank you for the food and for the other day. Look, I must confess, I and my friends enjoyed the food and even my father. Wow. So I want to say thank you. You don't need to tell me thank you. You don't need to. I should be the one telling you thank you. Thank you for allowing me cook for you and your friends. I really do appreciate it. You're welcome. <laughs> um, Amara, one more thing. Uh, please. Okay. I want you to marry me. Please. Marry you? Yes. Look, Amara, if you be my wife, I will treat you like a queen and also make you the envy of so many women. Anything you want, I would do it. Please. And you will not leave a day to regret ever accepting to be my wife. Please. Your wife? Yes. Marry me. Wow, this is great. Yeah? It's, you know, it feels good to see my son happy again. Yeah? Look at him. He now smiles and laughs, you know, <laughs> without any prompting. Ah, bro, bro. Yeah? Uh, my daughter, I thank you so much for accepting to be his wife. Yeah? <laughs> yes. Thank you so much, Papa. Babe, let me prepare something for Papa to eat, okay? All right. I'm coming. <laughs> <laughs> I must confess, I am more relaxed now. <laughs> she is actually the woman I needed all this while. Well, although I am still feeling a little bit of heartbreak, but I'm sure I'll get over it. Yes. You are even talking about heartbreak. What's heartbreak? It's a very simple thing to do. Channel everything to her. Eh? You can see she's a good woman, she's good to you, she loves you. She takes good care of you, she cooks very well. And she keeps the whole house in order for you. What else do you want in a woman? Eh? Not that useless idiot that calls herself princess. Eh? She doesn't know how to cook, she doesn't know how to uh, clean the, the house, does she even know how to clean her own body. Eh? Well, uh, she calls herself a princess. Uh, forget about her. Eh? This is the woman for you. This is the woman for you. 
uh, well, I thank God uh, some, for some miracles, you know. It happens sometimes. Now her personal maid is your wife. Uh, uh, Papa, she is not a maid. Just call her my wife, please. Okay. I'm just referring to her uh, from my experience as uh, the princess uh, as maid. <laughs> Papa, forget about her past. Just call her my wife. It's okay. And I like her just the way she is. Oh, oh. That's what I'm talking about, eh? That's what That's I'm talking right. about. All is well that ends well. Eh? <laughs> <laughs> and why did you prefer Chief Collins to be our king? It eh? is best known to me, you know. We did not even consider Princess Kambi oh, to be the queen. It is not possible now. I know your intentions for me to crown Queen Kambi, right? I will not do that. Have you forgotten that I am Ada Adure of the late king, the heir apparent of Uru Kingdom? Uh, my princess, I don't know from where you're getting or driving this, your notion. I don't know from where you're coming from. All I know is that in that day, you must get married. Yes. And secondly, a queen must be crowned. That's what I know. <clears throat> Hello? Your Majesty. <clears throat> I want you to send a message across to Princess Kambiri. Tell her to find herself in the palace now. Her presence is seriously needed. Yes. The youth, the elders, and in fact the entire uh Indigenous of this kingdom are expecting her to be in the palace to witness the marriage of her sister, Princess Adure, to the king of the kingdom. It is very, very important. Yes, there must not be any excuse at all. She must be present. Yes, conspicuously present. Thank you. Aha. Uh -huh. It's okay. Mm. <clears throat> yes. Oh no. Hey. Please. Please, let us not deviate from our culture. Kendugwe, we do respect. You shut up your mouth. I want to do that. I have forgotten we are learned educated men of this kingdom. Who are you to shut me up? I said, who are you to shut me up? In fact, who is Princess Cambri? Um, <laughs> I see you talking from both sides of your mouth. Why? Why? <laughs> well, um, you asked me a question. Who is Princess Cambiri? Yes. Good. Princess Cambiri is not a pawn at chess board. Yes. She's a vital, educated, dignified woman. And if you don't have forgotten, <laughs> she is the noble daughter of our king, King Alfred, the ruling king of our kingdom, Uru Kingdom. You heard it very clearly. Mm -hmm. Stop talking from both sides of your mouth. Mm -hmm. Why the Onowu did not let us know this before now? Well, if that is the case, then she should be invited. Oh, please. No way. That rascal, that psychopathic patient, she will not even honor your invitation in the first place. I mean, that princess is a crazy one. Why would you know we invite her to the palace and if not, the marriage will not take place? Well, I'm a king who respects customs and traditions. I think if this will cause, will cause issues, babe, you need to invite her. You need to let her know that she needs to be available. It seems you haven't been listening to me all this while. I said she will never come back. I insist you talk to her. Tell her that I specifically want her to be in the palace. She needs to come back from London. You know, I'm saying this so there won't be a problem. Uh, please, uh, Your Majesty, I suggest you call there Onu. You know, our festival is in four days. Please. 
I know, I understand. I understand, but we can't go against their customs and traditions. So let's do the right thing. It's okay. If you say so. <laughs> Your Highness, I am sorry. So sorry, Your Highness. But I want you to know that what we are doing is our custom. Princess Kambiri is also an Ada. And uh, there is no way she must be absent while her own fellow Ada, in the name of Princess Adore, is taking marital vows with you. Can't you see that some ambiguity there? It's not allowed by a tradition. And most importantly, a queen will be crowned before the marriage. Princess Kambiri is from Queen Oledo and her only child at that. So please, you push understand this matter. See the whole thing from this perspective because I know that you understand what is called tradition. As a custodian of your own tradition. I know. I understand your points. You have a very valid point there. But oh no. What if she refused to be? No. The princess can be that I know. Will not refuse to be present. I remember Sarada. She is supposed to be there to give us her own blessings. Eh? Like I said before, you push it on the stand with us. We are just doing our tradition. Majesty. I want you to understand that our people has absolute respect for your customs and traditions. Mm -hmm. We will neither bend nor disobey them. Thank you, Your Majesty. Hmm? Mm. Nothing. Hmm? It's okay. <laughs> so the ball is in your court now. <laughs> Take a step backward. That's fine. I just want to remind you that you're going to be my husband for a period of 30 days. After that, we'll go our separate ways with no feelings attached. I think we've discussed this before and You've paid me handsomely for it. I'm glad you remember vividly well. Yeah, I paid you well, and I'm glad you do remember. But I am just here to remind you, because I wouldn't want emotions to begin to fly around, thereby causing some side talks in the air. That would be detrimental to the royal house. We are in a contract. Relax. I know everything, and I'm going to do my part tomorrow. Relax your mind. You don't tell me to relax. I am the one to ask you to relax. Because you dare not go contrary to what we agreed on. So having said that, relax your mind and get the job done. It's okay. You may leave. Okay. Hey, come back. When next you come to see me, we are the perfume that I got you. You smell like a dead rat, and that is disgusting. For I am a princess, a royal one at that. Everything and everyone around me must represent royalty. Get out. 
got him a perfume, he couldn't even use it. Comes around me smelling like a dead rat. Poor people everywhere. Cha 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 cha. Orumba kwenu. Yeah. Orumba yano. Wano. Mwano. Zono. Kacha kwano. Kumbu no zono. Ha. You know your house. My elders. Abu elders. The entire people of Orumba Kingdom present here. I welcome all of us. I welcome all of you. I see now, who can come and come and see you? Today is a great day in our land. A queen will be declared to rule, to rule our land. Secondly, one of our princesses will be crowned queen for the king of um, over the kingdom. So today is a very good day for us. I urge us to come down and have fun. I am patiently wait for the arrival of the king of Obudu with his entourage. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Kingdom, sir. The Reverend Kingdom of the No, 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 Thank you, sir. Thank Somebody that made you, a girl that made you to be here. Because in this place we have about three princesses. And they're all beautiful. In fact, parade of beauties. We want to know that one that made you leave your comfort in all your glory. I don't want to be here this time. Oh no. Uh, simple, Princess Adure. Oh. Adure, which means I was right. His Majesty went ahead, came here, and dipped his hand in the cola sauce and took Ojugo. <laughs> Beauty itself. That's the reason we are here. Oh, that's the reason we are here. As tradition demands, please bring our wife. <laughs> oh, I do the goodness, Yaro. Her Majesty, let's have uh, Princess Adura here. Mm -hmm. Hi, you go to Ah, ah, Your Majesty, you have eyes. Ah, what is the madman doing? You understand me? Who asked you to come here? And who says he's a madman? My cousin is not mad, he's perfectly fine. What? Your, your cousin? Ha! Nadoze, my brother. You have done well for the kingdom of Obudu. I wanted a wife. 
I needed a queen for my people of Obudu Kingdom. Out of nowhere, Aduri came. She started throwing herself at me. She befriended my sister. She tried everything possible to influence our judgment. I decided to play the game. That's why I contacted my brother Nadozi. Nadozi, who do you think deserves to be the queen of my heart? Who do you think deserves to be the queen of Obudu Kingdom? Go ahead and point the princess. For whoever you point, I have chosen. My king and brother, indeed this world is full of evil. This woman, Queen Agatha, and her daughters are evil. Hmm? They tried to kill their stepsister, a girl with a good heart. Some of the elders are also evil. In fact, they are wolves in sheep clothing. The guys are our brothers. And they are also a part of the plan. They poison my food and demand for my head to be cut off. Hey! Without knowing that I was on a mission. And today, the mission has been accomplished. Just a minute, my king. My princess, can you recall what I told you in the cell a time ago? I'm not a madman. I was actually on a mission. What? I was sent by the king of the Buddhist kingdom. I've already told them everything that had been happening in the palace. Okay? Yes. What? See. Oh my god. See. This is the evidence. This is all up. Let's go. What's that? Hold this ring. What? What is this? Take this ring. This is to show you that you have been chosen to be the queen of a Buddhist kingdom. Okay? Oh, Take it. What are you? Take it. Coming back for you. We're coming back. Don't reveal this to anyone. Okay? Oh my god. We're coming back for you. I, shall go. I will be there with the okay. princess, but. So, you even tried killing him? Huh? And cutting off his head and carrying it on a platter? No, 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 Shut up! The same way she killed your queen and poisoned your king. Come, 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 come. You killed our queen and poisoned our king. No! Hey! I didn't do that! Ah, no problem. You must die. All of you. You and all these your evil daughters. You will all die. Oh no, I am not a part of it. I am not. You must be put to death, all of you. Abomination. Hello. Hey. But the king is not dead. What? Huh? What? He's alive. Oh. Ah! Your Majesty. Father. Your Majesty. 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 Your Maj
I am not dead. <laughs> I'm alive. You can tell you we don't in the air. What about you? You are not dead. Ghost of our land. You did try to kill me, but you did not succeed. The doctor that works for you confessed everything he did with you. It is quite unfortunate that you still do not know whom you are married to. I am who I am. Kreketem boy baba mo. Nkiz. Nozurumba. I've called the commissioner of police to organize his boys to get you apprehended. With your band of killers that you used in killing my wife, Olama, and attempted killing me. My, my Shut up! Don't say a word. Do not provoke me for that. I have been calling you. No. Go back. It is not yet your time. Go back and take care of her. Go back. Go back. Go back. Today, old fools, pathetic excuse for elders. I have heard everything you have done. I will address that later. The people of Obudu Kingdom has finally seen a queen. I have seen my bride, the virtuous woman my heart has always yearned for. Hey. <laughs> and she is princess. Orumba, Mamanu, Mamanu, Mamanu. <laughs> My dear, everything happened very, very, very fast. Like, as if I was dreaming. But it is good though. Hey. Hey. My house is very beautiful. <laughs> and what are you two unfeathered urchins doing in my man's house? <laughs> <laughs> Amara, you, as you can see, I'm in my friend's house. Ekene! Ekene! What are these two retarded creatures doing in your house? And what are you doing here? Excuse you? 
Yes. What are you doing here? Is that what she's supposed to be for me? Oh, I see. Well, if you must know, this is my beautiful wife. And obviously, she's heavily pregnant for me. And we do not need any disturbance right now. Exactly. The house is already filled and four will be a crowd. Please, can you leave? Please leave. Kindly use the door, please. Uh -huh. How are you doing? I'm fine. <laughs> it's okay. Hmm. Yes. <laughs> you guys should enjoy yourself, okay? Thank okay. you. I was actually doing something inside. Oh, no problem. All right? <laughs> right? Hmm. Look at that mat. What are you doing? Mm. Eh? Princess Maya, my friend and sister, how are you doing? I'm fine. You look changed. What happened to you? Yes, that is because God has arrested me. I am now a born again Christian. Oh, wow. Just like he did to Paul. So are you not a minister or what? Well, you can say that I am a child of God right now. Well, it's just so hard to believe, Annie. Yes, God has arrested me and his awesomeness is something but I look how we have here. Okay. Could you bring King Jordan? Please, King Jordan, I am here to apologize for all the wrong things I've done to you. Please forgive me. I know I've done unthinkable. I am sorry. I came here to tell you that I still love you. I love you so much from my heart. Please, forgive me. And it's okay, I hold no grudges against you, okay? But there is nothing I can do at this point. I'm married. You are married? Yes. Brother, I think you have um, something important to do before you came out. Yes, a whole lot of things. You can just go and continue. All right. Yeah. I'm inside. All right. Igwe. Igwe. So, urgent on the phone. Yes, Your Majesty. What is the problem? Your Majesty, I wouldn't say whether this is good or bad news. What news is it all about? What news? When Agatha is dead. What? Dead? Yes. Uh, <laughs> excuse me. She, she's dead. She is dead. And um, she took the shortest cut to hell by taking a poison. <laughs> well, uh, that's her own cup of tea. <sighs> that is the end of our uh, one face. Another news, Your Majesty. No, what other news? Which other news? This one, good news, Your Majesty. Since you came back, Your Majesty, your beloved daughter, Princess Kambili, has just put to bed. What? I mean it. She has delivered a set of twins. <laughs> Oh! A boy and a girl. But they cost me praise. <laughs> you say, <laughs> oh no, huh? not for me. Hey, when did this happen? Mm. happen today? When? When uh, exactly? About ten minutes ago. Huh? Yes. But we're not taking your calls. Oh yes, you know I was not quite close where my phone was. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, congratulations, Your Majesty. Uh, thank you very much. 
But I don't want to hold this joy all by myself. I want you to make news round. Let people gather. I must do merriment with this good news. It is good news indeed. Eh? Good news indeed. <laughs> Please, um, gather people. Let them come and, and uh, eat, dine and wine with me. This is not something to keep quiet with. You, wait. Wait. <laughs> you can start the calls. celebration through me. I just want to start making some calls for the merriment. Mm -hmm. not, mm -hmm. not mm -hmm. that. <laughs> yes. Uh, uh, hello? <laughs> yes. I'll be on my way, Your Majesty. Let me go at once and arrange the things. Oh, it's okay. Yes. Uh, uh -huh. <laughs> uh, okay. Wonderful. <sighs> 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 